What's new in the official build of Awaken OS version 1.10 based on Android 11 running on the POCO F1? Hey peeps, what's up? Manji here, back with another video. And let us go ahead and see what is new in the latest build of Awaken OS. Of course, this is the official build. The version is 1.10 running on the POCO F1. The first change you will notice is that the security patch has been updated to August 2021. The kernel they are using is Silvercore. SE Linux is set as enforcing out of the box. Now do note I am running the vanilla build with Nix stock G apps on top, which means I do have pixel launcher and select and screenshot are working without any issues. Press and hold on the empty space on your home screen, go into styles and wallpapers. And if you go into curated culture, you do have the three new wallpapers from Google, along with the three friendship day wallpapers as well. Next up, if you go into settings, security, make sure you do have face unlock setup and go into that option enter your pin and once you've entered your pin you will notice you now have a new toggle to skip the lock screen so if you enable this after face unlock it will directly go to the last used screen and ir face unlock works absolutely fine on this build it is super fast and app lock also supports ir face unlock fingerprint unlock and unlocking your applications via a pin in case you want to Next up, they have added the slider for alarm in your MIUI style volume panel. So if you go into settings, awaken settings, themes here and scroll down volume panel style, change it to MIUI compact. And now if I tap on this arrow, you will notice I have a new slider for alarm. And other than that, they have also added per app volume control along with the option to show per app volume. So once you enable this, if you are inside any application, say YouTube, you will now have the option of controlling the volume for that specific application independently. And while we're talking about YouTube, YouTube playback works absolutely fine. Live caption works, picture in picture works, of course, for picture in picture, either you need to have YouTube premium or you need to be in a specific country in case you do not want to pay for YouTube premium. With respect to Google Photos, you get either original quality or storage saver unlimited. Original quality is not unlimited. Next up, we can also try to edit a picture of my favorite football star to see if the feature of portrait light is working or not. So wait for the loading bar. Adjust portrait light bam here it is portrait light is working without any issues super important thing to note over here is that portrait light only works on human objects so if I try to edit a picture of my chicken friend over here portrait light will not work with respect to the assistant lady she is present and she will help you with the screen turned on and with the screen turned off as well with respect to safety net the device is not rooted right now i have only installed the magisk app to check for safety net so let us go ahead and check it so safety net is passing out of the box if i go to the google play store you will notice that play protect certification device is certified this means my banking apps should work without any issues in terms of the app opening animations here are the app opening animations on your screen right now as you can see no jitters no lags everything is absolutely fine with respect to the recents again same thing smooth but a smooth we can also check out our google feed to see if there are any issues and again no jitters and no lags in the google feed either let us try to switch between a few applications again everything is super smooth and super fast on awaken os and there it is peeps that is what was new in the latest build of awaken os version 1.10 official running on the poco f1 and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you